besides hey, still not understanding hey you guys what's up welcome back to my channel welcome back today's august 9th and it's 11 15. i'm about to head to school I'm just putting some perfume on. It's about to be time for me to go. So I'm going to take you all with me to class. I'm going to wash my hands. I was going to do my edges, but I feel like they look straight. Good enough for school. I'm just going to stretch my hair. It's 1117. I'm about to go to class. Maybe I put some blog or something on it. I feel like it looks fine. Okay. Y'all, I've got some yo. It's 1118. I'm going to put a little bit of foundation on underneath my eye. This is literally pretty much the same. Oops. Color of my skin. I'm just going to put a little bit on. Y'all see, I feel like it's hella blurring. I really don't do too much. Need a big brush in. Hurry up. Now top me go. My lashes are holding on by literally nothing, which is cool. I wonder if I have anything left in any of these. Okay. We about to go. All right, y'all, it is 11.23. I'm about to head to school, so let's go. All right, y'all, this is the fit. We're going to school. They not like us. Hey, y'all, so I am on the way to school. Um, I got y'all mounted up, kinda, so hopefully it's not shaking too bad or anything like that. I'm definitely gonna relook at this footage, and I'm gonna just think of different places to put you guys that will look nice. I'm kinda thinking right here in front of me. So, I don't know, but I feel like this is good for right now, you know? 
but yes i'm on the way to school i'm making pretty good time i guess i probably should have left a little bit earlier i'm drinking my duncan donuts iced coffee ready to tackle this day um i'm gonna come home and do lots and lots of homework as well and study yes but I hope y'all have been enjoying these past uploads. I am kind of, I am liking this angle. I think I just have to stop looking at myself. I have to just look at the camera. And yeah. So we're going to school. We're on our way to school. Should we do a little bit of a um, playlist? I don't think we can, but Lotto just dropped her new album. So I'm a low-key listen to it with y'all again. I start cross on when he be digging me out. I feel like a bad bitch. Pretending I'm getting along with he be need a band aid. She should run a fan page. They be popping shit. I see on me be hugs and handshake. Kisses at you. Yeah, you know this pussy. I don't fight for shit. That's right, y'all. So I am about to be at school. I'm looking at really late, so I'm just about to hurry up, park, and go to class and. Start taking my notes. This class isn't too long, so it's pretty much a lecture, not too bad. So yeah, but I didn't really go over the material. I'm not gonna put that in there. Good morning. Good morning, you guys. So I was recording yesterday and I didn't really record too much. So I decided I'm going to record again today. It's the start of my three days in a row. So I'm going to try to record as much as I can for you of me trying to navigate, um, keeping my life together while working three night shifts in a row. So firstly, I was watching my car last night and um, she was talking about this app. Oops this app called and don't mind my appearance you guys i need to um wash my face and do everything i just woke up she was talking about this app called um structure so you can fill it out and um just pretty much plan out your day so right now i'm supposed to be at the gym i was supposed to be getting ready but I was sitting on the toilet, so I was supposed to eat breakfast, but I was sitting on the toilet, so I'm about to hurry up and um, get going, get ready, and go to the gym. So, all right, y'all, I am all ready for bed. I just did my skincare, clean my piercings, brush my teeth. Now, I'm about to take me a little nap until five when I have to go to work. So, I'll see y'all um, when I'm getting ready for work in just a little bit. Hey you guys, I am on the way to work right now. This is day two, my second shift. Um, I'm about to get in the car and I'm gonna talk to y'all a little bit about my shift when I get in the car. Hey y'all, so I am now on the way to work. Um, I am now on the way to work. Um, <clears throat> I'm about to get there pretty much on time. It's day two out of two. So, yeah, yesterday was a pretty good shift. I had a good set of patients. One was uh, elopement risk. Um, one was kind of like pain management. And two, they were trying to get a diagnosis of them. So, it was pretty good. Um, I was saying I kind of want to switch around my set because sometimes you'll have patients that you just feel like are at risk to your license. Like, sometimes you feel like they're not telling you the truth or different things like that where you just feel like it might be a risk to your license. But, um, so I was kind of feeling like that about my set. Like, that, um, <clears throat> if you guys understand what, you, what I'm saying, y'all understand what I'm saying, but... We ended off the night good, and I'm hoping that during the day, they kind of were able to find out some more information about all my patients and stuff like that, and will help me out um, during my shift tonight, because one thing that I've noticed about working night shift, it's really hard to, it's not too hard, but especially when you get a new admin very late, sometimes it can get hard to gauge the orientation. One second, let me try and change my settings. 
I'm not sure if that looks better, but it kind of looks better to me. Um, my hair, I'm not really loving it, but I just did not feel like putting any like gel and stuff in it. So I'm gonna just leave it like this. Um, like normally I probably would put it up because it's looking really frizzy more than curly. <clears throat> But it's cool. I'm not really tripping. Um, work, work, don't stop. And I got some hair ties. So if my hair ends up getting in my face too much, I'm going to just um, put it into two buns or something. One thing that I've been seeing a lot of talks about or hearing a lot about in the nursing community, I feel like, is people not wanting to work at their job, y'all. I feel like nursing... I feel like nursing is one of the only professions where people feel like they shouldn't have to work at their job sometimes. Like, well, of course we have our good nurses and our ones that love nursing, which there are a lot of nurses out there. But it's always like a bad apple. Um, like, come on now. No, let me stop. But I'm honestly really tired, you guys. I'm very, very sore. Um, yeah, ready to go to work, get off, go home. <laughs> so ready. I'm not gonna lie, I really want a hot sausage. So I'm hoping to get, I get to work early so I can get me one. Yes. But I also have classes this week as well. I'm going back to school for my RN. I have an exam coming up this new week. So I need to be studying hard, which I am going to be. Um, yes, I'm trying to get out my um, car, buying my new car video for y'all. So if you haven't yet, go watch that video because y'all will see me purchase this new car, Big Alexis. So if y'all wanna see how I did that, um, definitely go watch this video, watch that video. And if you have any questions about car purchasing and things like that, let me know. This is the second car. Y'all, this is shaking so bad, like, mm. But yeah, I slept so good today. I slept so good. I slept real good. I can't force myself to go back to sleep. I'm like, sleep, 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 sleep. So, yes. Um, I don't even know. I'm still kind of like, feeling like a lot is going on. If you know what I mean. Like, um, it gets hard being an adult, but, you gotta do what you gotta do for sure so yeah i'm just taking it day by day and trying to trust in the lord that i'm on the plan that he has for me and in the name of jesus he will help me become the person he wants me to be and that's all i can really ask for if there's anything else that I want to talk about I've been loving my car though literally loving it um, it's been great
places sold different things because i really want me a hot sausage and a pickled egg like that would do it for me a hot sausage and a pickled egg like that would do it for me but i just don't know i don't know where to find it at but yeah, this is the hair. My hair is kind of heat damaged in the front. Um, I really want to cut my hair. I don't know. I feel like I look cute with a shortcut though. But I don't really care, honestly, if I cut my hair. If I don't, um, it's not really too big of a deal for me. I just be vibing. I'm glad I wore my hair out though because I really haven't been. But I just don't know. I feel like right now, it just should have been... Um, but it's still cute. I feel like I look cute. But if anything, I have my hair ties like I said. But at this point, I'm literally just rambling. Um, my camera is still doing that junk where it's saying lens error. So I'm honestly terrified that something might happen to it. But in the name of Jesus, it will last me. That's what I'm hoping for. Um, you know, this camera don't break on me. But... I'll let y'all know if I stop to go get a hot sausage. I probably won't because I'm kind of like right one time. But um, if I do, I'll let you know. Hello. Hey, YouTube. Hey, you guys. So um, it's currently 8.15. I'm just leaving um, my job right now. Y'all, it was a shift. It was a shift. When I say it was a shift, it was a shift. I got my last patient at 5.45, right before he's supposed to leave. Like, mm. Mm -mm -mm. That was a shift, y'all. One thing I'm going to say, too, is always make sure everything's done for your patients. Don't depend on the shift before you, okay? You always got to double check because it's going to fall on you at the end of the day. I am currently on the way home. I need a back massage. Oh my goodness. But yeah, you guys, apart from that, my shift wasn't too bad. Yeah, y'all, I'm just so ready to get home. Like, oh my goodness, I'm so ready to get home. Like, end of the night, patient with some dirty behind. But tomorrow's my Friday. So we're halfway through, I can't complain. My patients are safe and healthy, so I cannot complain. Um, I'm not sure if I'll speak to y'all too much um, between now and my next shift. I'll probably talk to you guys around the time I'll be going to work. up for like so long 
but I feel like the best thing for me in this next shift is to just like um, do me a little style or something. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a ponytail. Cause why not? Yeah, I'm gonna do me a ponytail or something. So maybe I'll just um, record me doing my hair later on for y'all. But that's all I have to say for right now. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I know I don't have any energy, but hopefully next time I see you guys, I will have a lot more energy. And yeah, I'm just gonna um, take a shower, eat some breakfast, and take my behind to sleep. Okay. My nigga ain't out of the tattoo. Oh, no, you ain't going through messages. Hey, y'all. Um, I am on the way to work right now. So, yeah, I'm kind of running behind. So, I was speeding on the way here. But, yeah, y'all. So, I'm going to talk to y'all tomorrow after work. I mean, yeah, tomorrow morning after work. After my three, I'll talk to y'all. Hey, you guys. Um, I'm off my shift. My face looks so oily, I know, but um i'm so tired i really don't have anything to say right now so i'm gonna talk to you guys later a school vlog so yeah hey you guys good morning it's currently 7 22 and um it is wednesday august 14th and i'm on the way to school make sure you like comment and subscribe i'm about to put my um camera on my car tripod real quick all right, y'all, so I am on the way to school. Um, this is going to be a vlog of my week, my school week. Um, I don't have work until Friday after school. So, yeah, I'm going to take y'all all the way through my week of school this week. Whatever. Um, so, I'm currently going to my physical assessment class. This class, we usually have um, a quiz in the morning. Then she demonstrates the competency and then if they if you want to check off you check off and then you um get out of class early oh if you want to check off you check off we do lunch then we come back and then we um study for the next competency so yeah i hope y'all don't shake you're not y'all are shaking so bad but all right so but in this class i had already did my competency last week for today so i don't think i have to stay too late to do that which is good because i do have a test on i do have a test on friday <clears throat> so anybody got time for that okay so yeah y'all today we have a neurology test and i'm not gonna lie i didn't do too well studying so we're gonna see how this quiz goes but you know i ace my competency so that's all that matters and it's crazy because Although I am, I would say, like, an optimist. Like, I try to find the, you know, the good side in everything we're doing. And everything in anything. So, you know, I honestly, I understand why people don't like school. But with nursing school, I really do enjoy it. Because I do like nursing school. Like, I want to be a nurse. And, like, well, I am a nurse. And as an LPN, in LPN school, we didn't learn too much about, like, physical assessments because that's the job of an RN and other things like that. So I hear a lot of LPNs, like, complaining about going back to school and da 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 da, -da. But I'm not going to lie. I am enjoying it. I'm enjoying learning new things. And I feel like every time I learn something new, I find a way to apply it to my actual job. Like, I had this um, patient who came in and it was a, a kind of like a mystery case like we really weren't, weren't like we really didn't know what was going on with him and he needed an mri but um he was he ended up finding out he was claustrophobic so the mri was delayed so at that point it's like um you know we really were checking on the brain and then he started getting a couple of different symptoms so i had to do me just like a little neurological exam and if i wasn't in school you know i probably wouldn't have um known exactly what i was supposed to be doing of course um as because i've been a nurse for about a year and a half you pick up things along the job you um find people to help you like my um buddy in on my job like um she's able to help me and then i was keeping um the rn that i have with me like um with me and you know 
not with me but i was keeping her in the loop of what was going on so that she could give me some advice and things like that but i was just so happy that i had just took my neurological physical assessment thing the week before so i knew exactly what to tell him so it was really nice um speaking of that i have my pin light and i had to take some batteries from work so i need to put them in my pin light <laughs> i think it's my nursing bag but yes y'all i am um going to be arriving to school right on time which is good i ain't mad at it um and hopefully i'll be leaving early because i did my competency last week i tried to get a friend from school and, and you know get with her so we can study for the competency that's the week the week after next our respiratory competency but um sometimes our teacher likes the competencies to be done a certain way and i really wasn't understanding how we should have it done for her and she didn't show us anything beforehand or anything like that so um yeah we had just said we will hold off on that and we'll just do it like the normal days the normal day it's supposed to be done like with the rest of the class so yes um only thing i really want is some celsius from the gas station and i thought i was gonna have like five minutes to spare but i'm obviously hitting every red light so i don't think i'm gonna have time and i forgot my freaking jacket at home like mm, i'm about to be so cold i have a jacket but i really do not want to wear that into class because it's a work jacket eh? there you y'all if you guys work at the hospital or you're nursing anything like that it's about to be time to start wearing our masks again like it's been so many patients that i've been having that um like have been having covid and we're not finding out until um like a lot of people have been exposed if you kind of get what i'm saying and i don't know whose fault that is in that case it hasn't been any of my patients so you know i can't say for sure what's going on but it is very frustrating, you know, when you're in a patient's room and stuff like that. And it's like, you think they don't have any um, contact precautions, even though you're still supposed to use um, safety precautions. But with COVID, you don't usually walk around with the N95, you know? And although, although, you know, some nurses like to wear a mask and stuff like that, but it's like, I don't know if that happened to you during COVID, but I know when I, <clears throat> was wearing a mask every day for working at mcdonald's we had no time off y'all the mask was breaking my face out when you wear glasses Red your glasses light camera ahead your glasses be getting all fuzzy and stuff i mean not all fuzzy all c c cloudy i don't know but yeah y'all mask is just a whole thing but i'm definitely gonna have to start wearing my masks and stuff because don't nobody have time to keep getting sick and the one thing that really sucks at the hospital is they do not have good um sick days for nurses which is surprising but they don't so it's like mm, i can't i can't i genuinely can't but like i said i have 30 minutes i'm um on the way to class right now i made me a egg sandwich so that's what i'm eating for breakfast i brought some leftover food from lunch my um, boyfriend got me yesterday for lunch today i made an egg sandwich but i'm gonna talk to y'all later hey y'all so it is currently 6 52 um i went to school this morning i did my test we practiced for our competency um maybe i can practice with y'all a little bit tonight but i've just been doing a little bit of studying um for my test i have on friday and i broke my um laptop and ipod ipad charger so i kind of like used it until it was about to die and i took a little bit of a nap i ate some food and now i'm going to walmart to go buy a new charger and i'm also gonna buy something else because i'm thinking about um like kind of fixing up my room i don't want to do anything too crazy because of course i need to study i don't want to take away from studying but um i find that i think i need something um to like <clears throat> I need something for my creativity, y'all. Like, I need to, I need to do something creative. I need to, like, yeah, I think that will be best for my mental health right now. <laughs> 
yes but I do have a lot of work to do I have a lot of work to do so no joke I'm doing work doing homework all right y'all I'm talking to y'all later all right this is editing me i did not close off this video correctly so i just wanted to close it off and say goodbye thank you so much for watching this video make sure you like comment and subscribe if you like content like this because this will be my life for the next year um school work balancing it all so yes if you want to join along in my journey definitely hit that subscribe button thank you guys so much for watching especially if you got to the end to any friends and family that are watching this video i love y'all thank y'all so much for the support more is to come you guys literally so yes i will see you in my next video so make sure you subscribe and you stick around because there is more to come bye <laughs>